So this week, uh, we've been trying to do like a comment of the week type thing, and I kind of have two awesome. that are that are that are tied right here. So the first one uh, right here was from Kenneth Glee ATLGA. He says the new legacy inheritance will be your when your parents leave you a three percent mortgage. <laughs> I have not seen that question. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I think uh, back to kind of the first question we started with. The reason we had a crash last time is the debt was a liability. That's why the banks had to take it back. The reason creative financing, sub two, innovation, you know, all, you know, assumptions are taking off now is because the debt's an asset. And he, and uh, this comment's absolutely right. If if you pass on and you give your debt to your heirs, um, that's an asset. I, I, I have said many times that if you have a rate below 3%, it's the best asset you're ever going to do. Think about that. I think there's a good chance that inflation average is two and a half for the next 30 years. If you borrowed 30 year money at two and a half, you won. I mean, it's crazy to think about. Yeah. Yeah. And, and to the point you said earlier, you know, you may never see that 3% mortgage again in your investing lifetime, which, you know, they are going to eventually, as they get paid off and people refinance or more people sell and buy, it's just going to get more and more rare. And with scarcity comes value. When people sit there and go, You got a 3% mortgage from your parents that was formed 20 years ago? Wow. Wow. That's cooler than getting a Benz. That's for sure. There you go. 